Peter Thornton killed an innocent man today, and I'm responsible. I was careless. When I killed Dr. Robert Milson in his office, his protege saw me, the darkest part of me. He stared into the abyss and witnessed a kindred spirit. I have to keep Deb safe. I made up an excuse for her to stay over at Camilla and Jean's for the weekend. If tonight goes wrong, they'll take care of her as if she was their own. They were more than friends to my parents. They've been like family. They're good people. I can't say the same for my Echo. I have to introduce Peter Thornton to the code. Without it, he's just another killer. Without it, I would be too. But unlike me, it won't be his salvation. Thornton crossed a line when he killed that campus guard, left the body for the police and me to find on my way to class. He won't stop killing until I give him the one thing he wants most. And it's not the curly fries. He wants to connect. To no longer walk alone. To meet his maker. I'm more than happy to oblige. Growing up, my father and I used to hunt. It wasn't for sport. It was to stave off my dark passenger until I was old enough to understand. Those hunting trips were all about teaching me the code. The number one rule, don't get caught. It's the only way you get to kill another day. Tonight's the night. I'm going to put my father's code to the test. Either I'm its worthy heir and I survive, or I'll be consumed by my spawn. It's how it should be. Hunter, pray. Let the game begin.